I do think there is a connection between postmodernism and a decline in higher education, and it is connected with a denial of objective truth. Right? If you have your truth and I have my truth, if truth is relative, if there is no fixed reality that we can all, as it were, kind of have a, a shared picture of, then a lot of disciplines that, that I value are really dead in the water. Um, and ironically, science is also dead in the water because science is also a discipline, a picture of reality. And if there is no object of reality, then science isn't giving us truth either. Again, a lot of people haven't thought that one through. Um, but I tell my philosophy classes, we do introduction to philosophy, and we start off with a discussion of truth and logic. And at the end of that chapter, we say, look, if the answer to this question is there is no truth, that there's your truth and my truth, then we're done. Then the rest of this course really is insignificant. It doesn't matter because all that we're doing is talking about my opinion and your opinion. Um, there is no truth for us to pursue. And so why bother talking about philosophy of religion? Does God exist? Does God exist for you? Okay, great. Does God exist for me? No. Well, great. You know, you have your truth, I have mine. Uh, but other disciplines are in the same boat. Anthropology, sociology, psychology, um, aesthetics, music. I mean, it's all just a matter of opinion, perspective. So why do we bother? Why, why come to class if, I, if we're not learning anything? Why go to chemistry? Why go to biology if you're not learning anything? Um, I sure hope that nursing students are being taught objective truth. Um, that, you know, this medicine will kill your patient. This medicine won't, therefore give him this medicine and not that medicine. I, I hope that they're learning objective truth. But I, I, yeah, I do think there is a connection.